What's happening, YouTube? It's your boy, Patrick Severin. It's a beautiful Saturday in New York. I can't believe it's in January and we're in 50 degree weather. Sunny is beautiful out. So guess what? Today we're not going to do a gym day. Today is a day we're going to just relax. We're going to take it easy. Um, you work hard. You work hard at your job. You work hard at the gym. You work hard at your business or in school. Whatever you work hard at. They have times that you have to take a day and just relax. And just enjoy it. Like for me, fitness is supposed to enhance my life. It's not my life. Now, if fitness is your life, then that's fine. I completely understand that. I'm not going to hate on that. But for me, fitness is to enhance the quality of my life. And you have times that you just really have to just go out and have a good time and experience life itself. And that's what I'm doing today. I like to go out and get something to eat at new places. I like to just, you know, go out and do things different. And today, I'm definitely going to go out to a restaurant I've never been before. I've never eaten at. Um, so I hope the food is good. I've seen the restaurant. I've passed there. I know people who used to work at that restaurant. I'm not going to tell you the restaurant. I'm going to let you see it just like I'm taking you out to dinner with me. So we're going to go. It's around after 4 o'clock right now. So I don't know if you call that dinner or late lunch. But yeah, we're going to go to this restaurant and have a good time. Eat some good food. And I'm taking you guys with me. See you guys in the next clip. Better than anybody you ever seen do it. Screams from the haters. Got a nice ring to it. I guess every superhero need his theme music. No one man should have
that's their signature drink. <laughs> It tastes like summertime. <laughs> it tastes like summer. On the beach with aqua blue water and white sand. Like home? Definitely tastes like home. This is your boy, we're here at the spot. Could you believe it's an hour wait to actually get a seat? But you know, I'm gonna wait. Having a drink at the bar, having a syrup drink. I don't remember how to pronounce it, but it's good. It's like Brazilian rum, uh, so forth and so forth. But anyway, yeah, man. So I do have other clothing other than gym clothes. And um, I remember we had my Q and A. I remember when I had the Q and A, I was telling you guys that there's um, one of my vices is my watches. Or maybe I didn't say it in the q &A. I didn't answer that question. But one of my vices is watches. I love watches. I love, love watches. And this watch is one of my favorite watches. Because um, the movement is special. The movement, you can actually see the movement from the back of the watch. I'll show you guys. And when you put the watch, when you take the watch off your wrist, it actually stops working after a certain amount of time off your wrist. But if you look at the back of the watch, you can actually see the movement. And if you look closely, you can see it ticking. And you can see the movement actually going. I don't know if you can see it. It's hard to get that in. But you can actually see the movement in the watch. This is one of my favorite watches. Um, if you look closely, you see the brand of the watch. Go, perfect. saw this watch and I purchased it a few years ago and um, I hardly wear it but I love it and to, even to jump start the watch you have to wind it up you know it's one of those um, mechanical movements that you have to wind the watch up to, to, to make it don't try to take my style all right? get your own style all right so yeah I have other clothes than, than gym clothes I have this like khaki jacket because it's like 50 something degrees today and then underneath here, I have a camo shirt from Zara that out of all the clothes in Zara, this is one of the only t-shirts that actually could fit me. Even though it looks like I'm ripping it apart with my arms, but this is one of the shirts that actually could fit me. So I have this, I have some jeans, I have some blue jeans, and of course I have my, you know, my Gucci loafers on. So.
boy Patrick Seven. We just came out of Texas de Brazil. It was cool experience. I've never experienced that before. Um, I saw on the wall is a steakhouse, and literally, like you have this card. It's red, and then it's 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 red, and then it's green, and then you flip it. And when you flip it to green, then they come and they ask you if you want these certain types of meat. And if you flip it red, that means that you don't want any meat at the time. Pause on the meat part. But yeah, it was really cool. I had a good time. The drinks was good. The signature drink that you saw in the video is really cool and um, tastes great. And I had a good time. And so now it's time to get home and relax. What's happening YouTube? It's your boy Patrick Severin. You just saw my restaurant review video. Thank you guys for watching. Still here at the lab cranking up our content for you guys and it feels good. I don't mind. I'll stay here late at work right now in one of the labs that's being under construction right now. So I'm going to just do this really quick. Again, thank you guys for watching. <clears throat> Texas de Brazil. Very good restaurant. I recommend that you guys do reservations because I had to wait for about over an hour um, so that's the only thing I can say that's pretty bad about it um, but definitely make your reservations It's a great restaurant great for groups or just you on a date if you want to have a romantic evening the people are nice the waiter staff is great just make sure you make those reservations because you will be waiting there for an hour for two hours sometimes three some of the guys at least the bartender told the, told me some people wait for so you want to make reservations second thing is is that it's like a buffet so you don't want to eat too much of the buffet if my voice sounds a little groggy I am sick so um, still got to put out this content still got to keep grinding right lips a little dry whatever um, so yeah um, you don't want to go crazy in the buffet don't eat too much in the buffet and so you can taste all the different proteins don't want to say meat but the different steaks and the different cuts of um, proteins. So I definitely recommend the filet mignon and the lamb. Those two are great. All right, you can get it medium well, you can get it rare, or you could get it um, well done. But the well done will take a little bit longer. But I definitely do recommend that restaurant. Group settings, friends, family, or if you're going on a romantic date with your significant other. Thank you guys for watching, and like always, please. Subscribe, comment, like, and share. Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. Hey!